Now here's Guy Lambert with the top three things you need to know. Hey, on a good Tuesday morning, Tiga Tiga B. In the news this morning, a D.C. woman claims an Uber driver pepper sprayed her following a dispute over a car seat. President Trump says, hey, it wasn't me. This morning, he's denying allegations of an affair with Stormy Daniels. And wait until you hear the lengths a drug addict went in order to get his next fix. Yes, it's all a part of the three things you need to know. But first, let's get the latest look at the Tuesday morning commute. What's up, Scott? This report is brought to you by Walgreens on 95 northbound, starting to see delays through Woodbridge from 784 to the Prince William Parkway. 295 southbound, slowing from Burroughs Avenue toward Benning Road. And in Capitol Heights, 214 eastbound, there's delays from Central Avenue headed toward Addison Road as they clean up some overnight road work. Walgreens has your trusted favorites in cosmetics, skin care, and hair care, plus new premium and exclusive beauty products. Stop by and find what makes you feel beautiful. I'm Scott Brady with traffic on WPGC 95.5. This morning, a D.C. woman is crying foul following a rather unusual encounter with an Uber driver while with her young son. According to Shamika Duvall, her Uber driver denied her a ride when she attempted to place her son's car seat in the car. The Uber driver was like, oh, he's not taking us nowhere because my son needs the car seat. She says the two began to argue. She then called 911. She then waited for the cops to arrive, refusing to get out of the car. That's when things got real ugly. So, so then, then he, he grabbed, grabbed something, something on the side of his door. door. He, he turned, turned around. It was pepper spray. Get out of my car. Oh. Get out. She claims the driver then pepper sprayed her and threw a bottle as she exited the car with her six-year-old son. He don't need to drive Uber. It makes the, it, it, it's not just for me, it's for other people's safety. According to Uber, both of their accounts now on hold pending the outcome of an investigation. Well, President Trump says, hey, it wasn't me. He's denying allegations of an affair with adult film star Stormy Daniels. That's according to the White House spokesman in a briefing yesterday. He also cast doubt on Daniels' claim that she was pressured to keep silent and threatened by a man in a parking lot in Las Vegas. <laughs> Finally, from our crooks are stupid department, Joe, Sonny, get this. Over in Olympia, Washington, police say a man high on meth came to the conclusion he wasn't high enough. Hence, he went looking for better dope. It just be calling me. It right? just so happens that while looking for the dope, his car ran out of gas. Dope! But Michael Thompson was on a mission. Police say he wandered into a parking lot where he then stole a semi-truck. <laughs> just one problem. He didn't know how to drive the daggone thing. As a result, he purposely crashed into a fence, hoping it would slow him down. But that didn't work. He then crashed into two more fences at a military base, ended up near an airstrip. Whereas bad timing would have it, special forces military exercises were underway. Thompson made his way across a runway, nearly struck by a plane, then saw paratroopers fall from a plane over base. Thinking they were coming for him, he ran away. He was later tracked down and arrested by police after they found his wallet that he left behind in the semi-truck. You're an idiot. That's and a lot that going he on. Is. That's a lot happening. It's a whole lot going on, but he bust through a, a Air Force base mm -hmm. and ain't get shot? Yeah. And if I go in 7-Eleven and touch the <laughs> potato chips wrong, they gonna tase me? Where's the... Something's not right here. Yeah. It's 558. Your forecast coming up next. Download the all-new radio.com app and listen to WPGC 95.5 anytime, anywhere. What's up? With Zillow, you're not just looking for a house. You're looking for the kitchen where you'll bake your baby smash cake. The extra bedroom where your sister will constantly crash. You're looking for a garage where you'll park bicycles, tricycles, and every mode of transportation. Except your car. You're not just looking for a house. You're looking for a place for your life to happen. And whether buying or renting, Zillow makes it easy with smart search features, photos, and more. Zillow, find your way home. Wow, little Danny looks so cool in his Nike. The color, the graphics really stands out. 25% off select Nike apparel and shoes for the family at JCPenney. His mom's dress looks so chic. She got it for 20% off with her JCP credit card and coupon. Wish I knew where they shop. JCPenney, definitely. Hurry into JCPenney today for spring savings on great items for the whole family. Or take an extra 20% off with your JCPenney credit card and coupon. JCPenney, style and value for all. Coupon valid 326 to 328. Credit offer subject to credit approval. Nike excluded from coupon. Other exclusions apply. See store at jcp.com for details. 106.7 The Fan is first, first, first with breaking sports news. Tune in at the top of every hour and 30 minutes past the hour for sports news live from the Crop Metcalf Five Star Sports Desk. The Redskins. I don't know what suddenly got it going, but it made a big difference in the outcome. National. Scherzer rocks, kicks the pitch. Swing and a miss! Wizards. Some news on John Wall. Capital. Oh, 
college football and basketball, and more. Tune in every 30 minutes for the latest scores, highlights, and locker room interviews. Now your WPGC FM HD1 Morning Side Washington DC forecast. Partly cloudy skies for today. Hey, grab an umbrella. Just a slight chance for a couple of passing showers. It's going to be chilly today. We'll top out at 49. Currently 35 degrees in the nation's capital. I'm God Lambert. You're up to date. It's the Joe Claire Morning Show on PGC. Welcome to DC. Now join the Operation Primetime Feed, already in progress.